Hello everybody and welcome back to the final three videos of E3. In the last episode we did third place but first what the fuck is this? What the fuck? What the fuck is this Minecraft? What, what are you playing at Microsoft? What's this shit? What is this shit? Look at him. Look at this man. He is scared shitless. He's so scared he fucking died. I know, dude. It's... I know. Just, just go on. I'll save you. I'll save you. Go, dude. Go. Be free. Get off the... Get off the madness. What is this shit, man? What the fuck is this? You couldn't... You couldn't wait till the end? You couldn't wait till the end of E3? We were so close. We were nearly done. You couldn't wait till the end of E3. Okay, fuck you, Microsoft. Piece of shit. Don't ever, don't ever let me see you doing that shit again. You know, I'm going to back up. And it's not going to affect us. Because we're going to be saving the game. And probably never playing it. But don't let me see this shit again. That's your warning. Anyway, where the hell's the pedestals? So yeah. Third place went to Mario Odyssey. So who takes the silver in our E3 lineup? Who was second best out of the Crash Insanity remakes and the official Metroid 2 remake? So I guess it's OM2R. Oh, okay. That's a tough one. That's a real tough one, that is. You know, you heard how much I was I was debating on who takes third. Now you're going to make me choose an even higher place. Don't make me choose! So, uh, <laughs> um, I, uh, I mean, does that, does that as well? And I mean, it doesn't matter which way round do it. People are going to be objectively pissed. I mean, you shouldn't because it's it, it's the top three of E3. They all got five out of five. Just ones get like 5.1. They get a little bit higher. I, oh, I'd, I'd have to say that the second place... Second place of E3 goes to... There are other reasons, but this will be the reason that I'll, I'll give during AM2R, and the other reasons will become apparent in first place. But I'm going to give second place to AM2R, the official Metroid 2 remake. Fuck you, Spyro, piece of shit! How dare you! No, hold, hold the phone, okay? So... Uh, let's just knock all of this stuff off and we'll get into it. So, pre-rendered, 0 out of 5. There was no pre-rendered cutscene bollocks. All great. Now, when I saw this... Well, this is this is Reel's reaction. Um, what the... What the fuck? Is that... Oh no. <laughs> no way. He wasn't dead, he wasn't dead. The 2D is the Metroid thinking that supposedly was dead is alive. And that's tame compared to my reaction. If you wanted me to recreate my reaction, I can't. It's 11 o'clock at night. And even though I live in a detached house and there is lots of, you know, bricks, then space, then more bricks in between the other houses, the other houses could still hear me. Like, my reaction was through the fucking roof. Like, I... I you know that Spongebob thing where it's like they drop the nuclear bomb and the mushroom cloud rises out of the ocean? That old meme? That was me! I'm like, OH SHIT! And that's, that's about as uh, much as I'm going to give 
because again it's 11 o'clock at night but just that oh shit you can tell how fucking excited I was for this so yeah I was I was um I was peeing myself I was like, oh, oh my god, this is, this is an official version. This is an, midnight, this is an official version. Mid, this is an official version. And um, Midnight got very scared. Had to call the police. The, the, the child is scared. The child, the, the, the pony child is scared that a spiral's reaction. So yeah, it was very loud. It was very energetic. And, oh, oh, it's, it's good. It, it's, it's fucking good. So, why did it take second spiral? Okay, so let's tell you a story. This was always going to get in the top three. This was like the second, the second that I saw the Alpha Metroid. I was thinking, yeah. But then when I saw the little counter after you kill the Alpha, after I saw that little counter, it's like... 39 remaining and then you saw the, the Gamma and the Zeta and the Omega. It's like that's AM2R. That's the remake. That's the fucking remake. Top dollar. Take my money now. It's Devolver Digital throwing money at the screen. We're going to literally invent a way to throw money through the screen. Yes, exactly. So it was, it was uh, hype all round. So this was always going to get into the top three because AM2R or let's take it back the original Metroid 2 for the Game Boy was the first ever Metroid game that I played so like when AM2R come out when the when the unofficial remake come out I lost my fucking mind I was like <gasps> oh my god it's the best fucking shit ever and that's why when it got taken down by Nintendo that's why there was blood. I'm like, you fucking what, Reggie? My first ever Metroid game remade into this amazing glory and you're fucking taking it down? You're taking it down on me, Kimishim. Oh, oh no. Wait there. Oh no, you didn't. Don't fucking do that. And you better fucking apologize for that. I want an apology on my desk. By the time I wake up, I want to check those YouTube comments and I want to see the official Nintendo YouTube channel apologize for taking that shit down and also include that man's Game Boy version with your official 3DS version. The official 3DS version's better. Stop trouncing the man. I mean, I can see why they did it now. They obviously did it because they had their own Metroid 2 remake in the, in the pipeline, but it wasn't quite ready yet. But still... It was very irresponsible for you to act that way. Don't fucking do that to my first ever Metroid game. And probably one of my favourite Metroid games outside the Prime series. That's a bad Nintendo. So this was this was my first Metroid game. It was when I saw that all those different Metroids. And they said, it's the Metroid home planet. It's a remake of Metroid 2. It's like, that's it. That's it. So it's automatically in the top three. It's right now, because obviously... Um, I saw other games and I was like right now it's it's gonna it's gonna be taking first place. It's gonna be taking first place. That's it, it's done. That's E3 is over. It's over, that's it, that's the winner. But of course other games come out and then I actually had to sit down and rationally think about it, but no matter what, it was never gonna get out of the top three. So it was like yes. So the graphics moving on to the graphics. They are they are great for 3DS graphics. It's it's so nice to see Metroid 2 in 3DS. Now I would have preferred it on the Switch if you're gonna remake it, because obviously ties are gonna be uh, drawn to the AM2R unofficial version, the Game Boy version, because 3DS they're still a little bit pixely. You could still say, oh, it's it's just a high-res version of AM2R. So it's like I would have preferred myself for it to to be on the Switch. Like, holy fucking shit! Oh, oh my God, Metroid 2 on the Switch. I want Metroid 2 on the Switch, Nintendo. Fucking scrap this 3DS version, make it on the Switch. Or just keep this 3DS version and remake it again on the Switch. Make a third remake on the Switch. That, oh, do it. Do it, please. 
please. But I mean, they won't do that. But that's fine because Metroid Prime 4 is coming to the Switch. And oh god, I can't wait to see Metroid and Switch graphics. Oh, oh, can you tell Metroid is one of my favourite franchises? Oh, it's going to be good. So yeah, I would have preferred it if it was like full Switch 3D. But 3DS is fine. I can deal with 3DS. So, you know, one point off because it's not on the Switch. And that would have been the most amazing, like, orgasm-inducing shit in the world. Like, come for days. But, won't quite. But still, uh, the, the Metroid home world is looking so fucking good in 3D. Yes. So, let's move over to the gameplay. It's, it's AM2R. It's exactly what everybody wanted. There's no bollocks like other M. There's no fucking shitty cutscenes about fucking mother, mother MB, Madeline Bergman, human mother brain, baby, baby, baby! Bullshit! None of that bollocks. There's no Super Adam Malkovich Galaxy. It's all fucking gone. It's fact to normal ass Metroid. It's you it's a 2D side scroller. You're exploring the planet, you jump and you shoot. And then you get some powers like the, the power bomb and the super missiles. You jump, shoot, you cut it's Metroid. That's what everybody wanted. That's what everybody's been wanting for ten years. People didn't want other M. People didn't want that shit which is Federation Force. I mean that's not even a real Metroid game. Like it has the Metroid logo, well that's just like Skyline the Spyro's Adventure. They did it purely to sell copies. That's not a fucking Metroid game. Get that shit out of here. Don't even t miss me with that shit. Don't even come to me and try and justify it as a Metroid game. It's not a fucking Metroid game. Get out of it. But, so, Metroid was fucking dead. And it's like, oh look, if you just make what people want, the fucking original. Well, you can see my reaction. Isn't it easy, Nintendo? When you don't fuck it up, isn't it easy? Yes! Yes, it is! And you took the original, and you took AM2R, because I noticed. Oh boy, did I fucking notice that you certainly took a couple of things from AM2R and added them to a, your official version. But you took the original and AM2R, and you're like, let's make it even better! And you have, like, the, the melee attack. So if a Gamma Metroid is flying at your face at a million miles an hour and you're not going to shoot it in time, you can punch it away and then engage in combat. So it's going to make the combat more dynamic and more fluent. And it looks great because you showed pure... Like, I mean, you've probably seen it on your screen playing for 600 years now. But like... um first place and like Mario Odyssey it was pure one hour one whole hour of pure game play goodness and you got a squishy we'll Metroid as an amiibo it's fucking squishy it squishes look at it look at it it squishes how can you go wrong you couldn't go wrong. And what's good about this remake is it's a remake, but also something new. Because when you kill the Metroids now, you have to take it back to this big golden wheel thing and you insert the DNA in it and it opens up new areas. So that means that you'll be exploring the Metroid homeworld in a different order. And it, it's like a, it's like Metroid 2, but new game plus with a fucking full fresh experience. And... And, 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 to top it off, you added shit from AM2R, which is the recharge stations that fully restore your health and missiles. Thank fuck, so I don't have to do that farming bollocks. And, and, you followed Hollow Knight, one of the games of the bloody year so far, if not the game of the year so far, in which you can put pins on the map like Hollow Knight, to decide where, like, areas you can't get to yet, where to come back to them, and you added the bloody stag stations for fast travel. Good! It's basically like you took Metroid 2 and fused it with Hollow Knight. If this, this is like Samus and Hollow Knight himself fucking and having a baby. This is their baby, and it's good. It's all fucking good. It's Metroid goodness. Six out of five. 
it's, it's fucking good gameplay. Final verdict. It's, it's 5.5 5 out of 6. It's that it gets higher than Mario Odyssey. Aside from the one graphical downgrade on the 3DS, I would have preferred it on the Switch. It's all looking fucking good. So you, Samus, I've already put you into the silver chest. And the, the, the floor is still fucking up. I'll have to fix that. But yeah. I'm excited. Can you tell? Can you tell? I need it now. Enderman. I need it now. Give it to me. I know you've got it. Give it to me, Skeleton. I know you have Metroid 2. That's a glowing 3DS. Give it to me. Fuck you. Get out of here. Don't, don't tell me I can't have it. Fuck you. My god, they take a lot of damage now. I didn't realise how much health the enemies have anymore. Clearly that's an update where they've got more health. I was hoping to just kill them in one hit. But whatever. It's good. We're excited. That's the end of the video. So, do share your thoughts on the Metroid 2 remake down below. Let me know what you're thinking. Am I overreacting? I don't think I'm overreacting. But let me know what you think down below. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, do feel free to leave a like. It does help out the channel. If you can't wait to see the grand winner and the reasons why, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button and bing the bell so the notifications go through. 903? Give it a second, 903, yes, yeah, still 97 away from the first big milestone. Oh shit, I just dropped the PlayStation 4 controller because I was downloading something. That's fine, but yeah, 97 away. I am so grateful to you all, and I love you all. And there are links below to the Twitter, if you want to see what I'm tweeting, the public Discord to come in and chat, and my Patreon if you'd like to support me. But for now... Thank you for watching, and I'll see all of you with the first place winner of E3. Say goodbye, Princess Amanetta. Goodbye. <laughs>